people are thirsty for craft suds. I think it's a change in people's taste. Um, people want to shop local, they want to try something new and different, something from the, the place down the corner. Niagara is becoming a hot spot for craft beer, partly because it already has the traffic with its pre-existing wine route. Oast House, Silversmith and Niagara College Brewery are well established and growing. They're just growing so fast, the ones that are in existence are doubling in capacity every year. And there are lots of new players entering the game. I am a very passionate beer drinker. Robin Ritisick is getting ready to open up the Exchange Brewery next month on Queen Street in Niagara-on-the-Lake. We are experimenting with a ton of different styles of beer. So in our first year lineup, we actually have 30 different brews lined up. She says the local agriculture is a huge draw. We have local far farmers making hops here, growing hops, that we can use, literally pick off the vine, throw into our brews a few hours later. We have great local fruit local herbs. We've had the unique opportunity to go into the local orchards and cultivate the yeast off the fruit. Proof that it is a truly local industry. In Port Dalhousie, the Lock Street Brewing Company is also getting ready to open next year. Craft breweries are popping up everywhere. In the LCBO, sales of craft beer are growing about 30 percent per year. The industry is booming and everyone, even the government, is taking notice. As of this month, a lot of that beer is now available in local grocery stores. With the industry growing at such a rapid rate, there's a demand for students who know the trade. That's where Niagara College comes in. They started their brewing program, the first of its kind, five years ago and now have students working all over the world. The brewmaster program here at Niagara College is two years long. There are 18 students in each class and there's always a wait list. Every student who's graduated from this program has landed a job in the industry. Students have made more than 250 different beers this year alone. The college has certainly helped the local industry grow, even helping local brewers develop recipes. Niagara is well positioned to have the best breweries in the country right here. With these breweries continuing to expand and many more emerging on the scene, it looks like there's no stopping the success of the local suds. I hope you're thirsty. Brittany Gogo, CHCH News.